Hey guys, so today we're going to make the comb holder. So what we're going to need for this tutorial is scissors, a hole punch, a roller, a pencil, and either glue or tape. I guess you could use a stapler too. So I'm taking some cardstock and we're going to cut a rectangle that is three and a half by nine inches. There's nine. I'm gonna go down three and a half and across nine. And now we're going to cut this out. All right, so now we're going to place dots along the top and the bottom at one and eight inches. Here's one, and here's eight. Why didn't do dots? Dots. Here's one, and here's eight. And now we're going to draw lines. Did not measure that very well. All right, now we're gonna place dots along the left and the right at one and a half. Oh, I'm sorry. Now we're going to place dots along the left and the right at two and a half. And this is a dotted line for folding on. Now we're gonna place dots along these vertical lines here at one and a half, two, and three inches. Now we're gonna hold the ruler on the dots and draw lines just to the outside. Now place the end of the ruler on the one and one half dot. until the one inch mark hits this line here. And you're gonna do that on the other side.
Now we're gonna place dots on the top. So make sure that your dotted line is now at the bottom at two and seven inches. Two and seven inches. And on the vertical lines at one half inch. So on these lines here, I'm gonna go to half an inch. So that's half an inch. And there's half an inch. Okay. Now we're going to draw from this dot down to this half inch mark a line. Now we're going to hold the ruler on those one half inch marks. And we're going to place a dot at one and a half and five and a half for holes. All right. So now what I'm going to do is punch out these holes here. Then we're going to cut on either side, this here, this here, and this here. So we're going to cut all of this stuff. Then we're going to fold and crease this middle line here. Let's fold it back and forth. Then we simply fold these triangles in and you're going to glue them together like this on e either side. But I think I'm gonna staple them. The last one I taped and didn't, the tape didn't really work that good. Maybe I'm not gonna staple it. I don't think I can get the stapler even in there. Maybe glue is the right way after all. A staple would just be so nice. If you have a tiny stapler, you might be able to do it. Put some glue on. yarn or string and place your comb right in and hang it up somewhere. There's the comb holder. And it's not glued in all the way yet. I made two of them. I try to figure out what I'm doing before I film the video when I can. Um, this one was kind of a little bit hard. Um, if you noticed, I made it upside down at first accidentally and then I had to turn around when it said make sure the top. <sighs> On to the next one. I hope you guys are enjoying these and you can see okay. And I know I'm not the best at filming, but there are no videos for these. And they're very necessary because, at least for me, these are confusing. <laughs>